Good evening, everyone. My name is Annie. We are playing Pokemon Emerald uh, for the last time tonight. This is my final day playing Pokemon Emerald. And how about we go fight the Elite Four? Uh, so yes, uh, we're at the Evergrande City. I did do some leveling up uh, a little bit. Gained uh, about two levels for everyone here. And I think we're ready for the Victory Road. So everyone is ready, I do believe. Uh, what else? Uh, they do have their HM moves. That was the thing, though. I was going to get rid of those once we finished uh, this dungeon. But I want to keep them on since I have no idea what HM uh, moves we're going to need for the dungeon. And that's kind of one of the things that really annoys me about uh, Pokemon. Because you kind of require to teach your Pokemon HM moves uh, during like the final Victory Road dungeon where they, at this point, they really serve no purpose aside from like Surf and sometimes Strength, I guess. But I uh, will be replacing them with uh, other moves at least. So yes, uh, this is our team. This is our, our last uh, survivors uh, since the beginning. And they've done really well. I'm really proud of uh, this team I was able to put together. Uh, rest in peace for my uh, Trico and all of the other Pokemon that I could have played. I remember playing an Azumarill too. Uh, spending some time trying to like train up the uh, the Meryl, only for it to like die during uh, the second gym battle. But uh, whatever, I've caught up. So, I'm going to take a little detour very quick, because I do have some berries planted. And I want to go check up on those. And then once we do that, we'll, we'll enter the cave. But I hope that everyone has had a wonderful uh, Thursday, or whatever day it is you're watching this on uh, YouTube. Let's go see our berries. Uh, the berries in question that I want to check up are on our uh, citrus berries. Oh, they're still not, uh... They're still not, uh, sprouted yet. Or, uh, they're not fully grown. Okay, that's perfectly fine. So this is kind of my fault, but... I was completely slow to grow any other berries, so... I will not be having citrus berries... <laughs> on me. Uh, during the upcoming uh, battles. But whatever. I have not been doing a very good job with uh, berry management. But uh, we'll see. Alright. So we are in Everground City, and this is Victory Road. I think I shouldn't waste like any more time. Let's just... Uh, Get on with it. Victory Road. Let me check my TMs. Okay, so I have some good ones that I can use. Alright. So this does technically count as a new encounter, so let's see what we could uh, scrounge up here. Okay, there's someone there. I want to get the encounter first. Alright, what do we got? We do have you already. Sounded like it said Yu-Gi-Oh, but uh, this counts. Uh, let's put you under attraction. Yeah, it sounded like Hariyama. Oh shit. Said Yu-Gi-Oh. But do not whirlwind. Okay. Let's do 
one more. Oh, I also got the amulet coin, by the way. Okay, nice. Do not whirlwind, please. Thank you. So I got the amulet coin uh, in our first town. I spoke with uh, our mother uh, a few times, and then, nice, we got him. And she gave us the amulet coin. Okay, we're gonna call you... Let's do this very quick. Do lowercase. Yu-Gi-Oh was a really good show, by the way. Like, still one of my favorites. Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay. Yeah, it just it sounds like he he said Yu-Gi-Oh. Let me just do this very quickly because I kind of want to make a uh, comparison. Sounds similar. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, so we do have a backup uh, fighter Pokemon just in case one of our party members dies during the uh, Victory Road. And speaking of which, uh, going through my inventory, I did also get the Yellow Flute and the Red Flute. The Red Flute gets rid of uh, Attraction, and the Yellow Flute gets rid of uh, conf uh, Confusion. So I farmed up the uh, the suit around that uh, smoky area. Okay, I also have some uh, heart scales too. So let me see. Okay. So we're still fine. Oh, hello. It's uh, Wally. <laughs> Hi, Annie. Is this a battle? I bet you're surprised. I am, actually. I'm very surprised. I made it all the way here, and it's all thanks to you. Losing to you that time made me stronger, but I'm not going to lose anymore. I'm going to win for the Pokemon who gave me courage and strength. Here I come. This might go badly. Okay, we're going to switch out. Um, uh, hmm. So this thing probably have I am worried about earthquake, but I think that was a gym specific thing. I don't want to get rid of Maggie though. Like this is a bad matchup already initially. I am nervous, though. So this thing will probably have Aerial Ace, but let's see what it does. it will probably do Aerial Ace first. Yeah, perfect. Alright, let's do... Because I know that uh, Winona's Altaria has Earthquake. I don't think this uh, Wally's does. Like, ground would be the only thing that would hurt us here. So I feel like I kind of want to take a risk and see what happens. Okay, nice. Paralyze. Okay, Dragon Dance. That's good. The Paralysis did help. Okay, nice. One is down. Delcaddy. Let's switch in uh, Mush Punch, because Delcaddy is normal type. And then let's do Mock Punch. Awesome. Okay. 
Gardevoir. Okay. This is his ace. Okay. Gardevoir might have Thunderbolt. It definitely has Psychic. Okay, so it has Psychic. But it might have Thunderbolt too. So let's see. Uh, do you have Crunch? Okay, you do have Crunch. Okay, what's the... Okay, you have the Focus Band. Kind of praying for uh, the Focus Band would help us here if we get KO'd. So Crunch would do Stab, though, I think. Okay, kill, please. Oh, damn it. Okay. All right, double team. I'll take that. That's fine. Okay, it's dead. Perfect. I am already sweating. Like, I am already nervous. Rosalia. Okay, not bad. Let's bring in Fluffy. I kind of am curious. Do we fight Wally again later on post uh, Elite Four? Magneton. Okay. We just bring in you. It's really cool. Everyone is getting a turn. Uh, let's do Dig. Well, mostly everyone is getting a, a chance to, uh, to shine. And awesome. You are strong after all. I couldn't beat you today, but one of these days I'll catch up to you. And that's a good mindset, like, keep at it, kid. But keep on going. It's good advice. Alright, I am actually going to dig out of here. And reheal up again. Edwin, I do not care. Alright, that was my first, uh, my first, uh, heart attack right there. <laughs> I was really nervous and sweating during that battle. The one thing this game kind of, uh, instilled a lot of fear in me was just the uh, the updated rosters of like any pokemon can have a bs move set that can absolutely destroy you there was a uh, brawly or winona zaltaria or uh, that random trainer when it was raining completely destroyed like three of my pokemon so i kind of expected that from wally but looks like he didn't uh, let's do return uh, I do want to fight these things. Just so I could get as, my, as much uh, experience as I can. Yu-Gi-Oh! Zubat, don't care. Alright, let's explore this way first, because uh, the direction where Wally was, was probably the way to go. Hello there. I didn't come all this way to lose now. The possibility doesn't exist. Magneton. Okay, good matchup. All 
I really wish that we could have gotten the uh, the lucky egg item here. That would have been really, really cool to uh, to have. Because the lucky egg item doubles experience, and I feel like uh, I would need experience here. I lost. We need to go around. Louder it. Encounters here are pretty frequent. again. Right. This will take a while. So I feel like uh, I'll make uh, some uh, some uh, stream markers to when we actually uh, get out of here for the, uh, the YouTube video. Like I did change up my, my uh, OBS setup to kind of include the uh, the buttons for the like the little pauses. Oh, it just uh, goes around. Oh. I'm so paranoid. I don't want uh, Mush Punch to get a wing attack. It's like my biggest fear right now. this go? Okay, there's a path over here. Let's go this way. Okay. So that led us back over there. And then this is just one big loop around. So where Wally was, was the right way to, uh, to go. Uh, we could return this one. Or what's over here? No. I'll need to he uh, heal up Maggie too in a little bit. Excellent. Good stats. Let's do a lemonade. And we'll raise much punch when we're level. 
So I think uh, the bridge here is going to lead to that item. Uh, we'll just leave here. Oh, come on. I might actually just do a, a repel here. At the very least, like, to uh, get away from the gold bats. There are a lot of gold bats here. Max elixir. Awesome. Okay, much better. Alright. So, let's go up here. And then around him. And say hello. The seemingly infinite and harsh road lives up to its name of victory. Fuck it, I'm gonna risk it. It's six levels up, so it should be... Okay. Shouldn't be a problem. Oh, crap. I forgot Flash was a thing. I really don't want to teach Flash to at Pokemon. <laughs> I really don't. Try attack, double team, underwave. So, uh, hmm. Magneton does not have very good physical attack. And with this generation, with this generation, the normal type tri attack here would be based on Magneton's physical attack, not his special. So I think it's kind of pointless to have a, uh, to have tri attack here. So we might replace this with, uh, Flash. So unfortunately, Magneton might just be a, a one-trick pony. So let's teach Magneton Flash as much as I would hate it. Come to think of it, I might uh, replace Flash with Substitute. So uh, Maggie could be double teaming, could be a double teaming Pokemon and then substitute itself. And then just paralyze enemies. So I think a Maggie might actually be my my trump card going forward. But okay, I'm just uh, talking strategy right now. Should probably just uh, get out of the cave first and hope Maggie survives. Okay, that did not even do that. Oh, I can still see things. Okay, I guess that says. As wide as it can go. Alright. Push this. I also think we need Rock Smash too in this cave. Okay, yeah we do. So, welcome to uh, pre-gen... Six Pokemon, where you still need to uh, use HMs. I mess that up. <laughs> I totally mess that up. Yeah, like in Gen Seven, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, Sun and Moon, they uh, they change the system completely so that you don't need to rely on HMs to get around. And it's such a welcome change. Like I really did like uh, Sun and Moon that generation. I think eventually I will play that again. 
That is a bad matchup. Still got hit. Mawile. That is a steel Pokemon. I really love Mawile's design. It's really cool. And I think in Gen 6, Mawile gets a Mega Evolution too. So hopefully I can catch one. Kadabra. Uh, let's go with... Uh, let's do... You. Uh, crunch. Awesome. Okay. And then up, and then break this. Full restore, nice, I'll take it. Stairs. So my next Pokemon Nuzlocke is not going to be for a while. The next game series I'm going to be playing will, uh, if you've seen my YouTube already and all of the uploads I've been doing, uh, we'll be continuing with, uh, with that game because I'm just so invested in it. And, like, eventually, within, like, the next year, I will be coming back to uh, Pokemon again. And the next Pokemon game Nuzlocke I will be doing is Pokemon Platinum. So that'll be Gen 4. And that'll be exciting. Let's bring out Avocado. So I'm really looking forward to doing a uh, Pokemon Platinum uh, Nuzlocke run. That'll be really uh, fun and exciting to, uh, to do. Tropius. Well, let's go back. I don't think uh, Tropius has any flying moves. So let's return. Please do not have a wing attack. Okay, body slam, I'll take it. Hi, Bond. How's your night? Uh, welcome in. Shit, I should heal that. Hope you had a wonderful, uh, wonderful day today. Body slam. Uh, let's heal the paralysis. So it's only doing body slam, so that's fine. So I am wrapping up this game uh, today. Um, fighting through a cave and dungeon full of trainers, and we're going to be uh, fighting the, uh, the super bosses, the elite four of this game. Well, let's heal up here. Just got home from rehearsal for the nut Nutcracker. Ooh, just performing here this weekend. Awesome, awesome. Good luck with the uh, the Nutcracker. That sounds really fun. Do you have Waterfall? 
let's climb up uh, the waterfall. And is there any uh, Pokemon around here? Uh, trainers. Okay, there is one. So yeah, we're doing the last stretch of uh, the game. Uh, Vito. Alright, let's switch. I did some damage. Oh jeez. I did some damage. Uh, just in case, I'm gonna full restore. Here, use our first full restore. Jeez, that was a crit. Oh, come on. Okay, so the crit was uh, 34 damage. Alright, Vito, your uh, Dodrio is pretty, uh, pretty strong. My luck is not... I'm not having good luck right now. There we go. Kadabra. Uh, let's switch. Let's do... Uh, your, uh, your special is horrible. We'll bring in uh, Fluffy. Okay, and then let's do uh, Dragon Breath. So I think Dragon Breath is physical in this generation. experience electrode Let's bring you in and dig Okay nice Not damn it. Alright, come on. Awesome. I am really nervous of a uh, of a uh, self destruct. I'm so nervous. Hold on. Negates one hit KO attacks. Oh, actually, that's really useful. Let's bring in Maggie. That actually might be useful. Let's switch in. Oh, fuck off. So I think we'll be fine. So let's just uh, heal everyone up here. Having so much bad luck with the uh, status effects. <laughs> or hold on, I read that wrong. Uh, the self-destruct was just a normal attack. It wasn't a one-hit KO attack. Guillotine is a uh, I'm I'm stupid. I'm really stupid. But our our defense did help though. Like I survived the uh, self destruct. Yeah, self destruct was not a one hit KO move. 
uh, it was just a really powerful attack. Oh, come on. Okay. Perfectly fine. Special attack. Alright then, I can do this then. This is the guy. This is the the guy from uh from much earlier, the uh, Winstreet house. This is Vito Winstreet. Better than my family. Is that possible? Because uh the family was I fought the family members and they were basically saying that uh that our our uh, our uh, grandson is the strongest trainer out of all of us and this is the guy. This is a uh, Vito Winstreet. Well, that's cool. Nice that they brought that all the way around. I forgot about this. Yeah, it was a family of four trainers that we did early in the game. And I beat all of them. And then they said, uh, Oh, don't worry, Vito's gonna stomp you. And he, uh, he put up a challenge. A good challenge against us. Good job, Vito. That was really, really fun. You must be Ugh. You must be getting a little tired. I can't talk today. Another bad matchup. You can just tell Maggie is going to be our MVP today. Sableye. That is a ghost and a dark type. So let's bring in Avocado. Damn it. Uh, Shadow Ball. Thankfully, I have a yellow flute. Jeez. Yeah, that was 57. I'm very carefully calculating how much damage a crit does to my HP. So that it doesn't do like, uh, it doesn't knock out the the Pokemon completely. Okay, that might be a problem. Jeez. Okay, let's uh, let's switch that up and do. Giga Drain. Macho Brace. It might actually be it too, because uh, I have the Macho Brace equipped. I'll probably take that off.
Yeah, let's take that off. To uh, reset uh, Avocado's speed. Oh, fuck. <laughs> ah, damn it. I was trying to avoid the double attack, the uh, double team. Plato and Metacham. All right, so we're gonna have to switch out again. Okay, so avocado, come on out. And then you can fly. It's a good team, though. Like a really good team. Nice. Oh, threes across the... Well, mostly across the board. That's really good. Uh, two at once? Wait, wait. Wait your turn. Yeah, double, uh, double battles in this game are kind of uh, stressful. <laughs> to Dragon Breath, because kill this one. Jeez. Okay, we're faster. That's really good. Okay, they're both dead. Alright, and then one more Lantern. Uh, Giga Drain. And then you can uh, fly. Yeah, so it was a uh, a double trainer battle that killed like uh, three of my Pokemon in one battle, and it was not uh, it was not fun. Uh, of course, you're gonna do a full restore. Okay, I'll take the uh, defense drop. Uh, Dragon Breath. Okay, good. Excellent. I love level ups. So the reason why I equipped the Macho Brace was to uh, was the extra stats here. Like I now have a five at a five on defense, so the Macho Brace really helped with that. But uh, it lowers our speed, so I'll take the uh, the extra defense. Like I need fast Pokemon right now, is what I need. Okay, so we need Sally and. Blahaj to uh, pick up uh, some levels. How are you doing? Okay, we're almost there. Okay, it's just you. I heard that there was a tough little kid around. Did they mean you? Alright, next up. Owen, Kecleon. Let's do Mock Punch. Waylord. Ah, uh, hmm. Whaler just has huge HP. I don't think it has anything to uh, worry us. Also, fun fact, did you know that a Waylord is 43 feet long? Yeah, it is a really big uh, whale.
Excellent. Graveler. Okay, let's bring you out. little shrimp just absolutely destroyed you. Alright, so let's switch out Mush Punch. Hey, it looks like I've been here before. Yeah, I think I've been this way, but let me check here. I think I fought you already. Yeah. Okay, so it just uh, circles back. Okay, so we can take the, uh, the ladder up here. Oh, nice. Psychic is really strong. But can anyone learn that, is the thing. Okay, no, no one can learn it. It's kind of a shame. I'll take it though. Let's see, repel. That's where Vito is. Oh, okay. I was on the other side. I see. Okay, so there's a, a split here. What's up here? Alright, another uh, double battle. Oh, come on. I didn't even run that time. Like, they normally lock onto you when you run past them. Alright, let's do two dragon dances here. Boost our attack and our speed. I am so glad I got the yellow flute to heal that. I'm gonna switch out. Absol. All right, perfect for uh, Sally. Yep, very nice. Uh, let's do Brick Break because you need experience. So I don't know how many trainers are in this place, but we might be halfway done with them, I think. I think this guy is a psychic trainer. Yep. 
Alright, it's kind of a bad matchup. I don't think they have a, a rock moves, or very strong rock moves at least, so I think we can... Or let's put them to sleep first. Or not. Okay, it's just a psychic. Okay, that should do neutral damage. Alright, that's doing a decent amount. Uh, let's switch with you. What's your stats? Okay, you have very good uh, uh, special defense. So we'll switch out. Yeah, that might be uh, problematic, but it's fine. That has uh, special damage, which is what uh, Avocado is. Special attacker. And then, yep, you have Soul Rock. Okay, reflect. isn't the goal, it's only a place on the way to the Pokemon Lake. Torkoal. Okay. Uh, let's put you to sleep. Okay, you're probably going to protect, like, all of the time, so I'm going to Dragon Dance a few times. Iron defense. Stop missing. Alright. So unfortunately, he raised she raised uh, her defense, so we're gonna have to switch out again. And go with a special attacker. And super effective. And a crit, nice. Metacham. Alright, we'll bring Fluffy back as type advantage. Okay, you are boosting your stats. Thankfully it's not defense. And you're dead. <laughs> Ludicolo. Okay, perfect. Awesome. All right, excellent. Okay. I'm going to save here because it looks like uh, ads are going to start. So I'll pause here and we'll, uh, we'll take a break. So I'll get up and stretch uh, and we'll come right back to, to this. I'll let the ads run and then when we come right back we'll continue exploring Victory Road. So as a reminder to get up, stretch, take care of yourselves, drink water, and I'll be right back. 
Hi everyone, I hope you all had a wonderful break, and I do believe we are ready to uh, continue. Alright, so let me check my uh, roster again. Okay, you need experience. So, what can uh, amulet coin, wax, incense... Uh, I want to help, uh, let's take that off. Just give you the focus band. So the focus band uh, prevents uh, one-hit KOs. It only prevents uh, fainting. So let's give that to Sally. And on our way. Okay, looks like there's another waterfall. Wait. I think I've been here already. I fought these two already. Yeah, I've already uh, fought these guys. Yeah, I fought those guys already. Unless I need to uh, take the waterfall up. was here before. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, fuck right off. It's always a critical hit. <laughs> this game does not like me. It really does not like me. Okay. Bought those guys. Oh, hello. Sableye. That's fine. So we already got our encounter here in Victory Road, which was uh, a Hariyama. Okay, we fought that person already. Okay, this is a dead end. Yeah. Though I think, honestly, getting lost here might be a good idea, actually, just because, uh... I'm getting, uh, some decent experience. I kinda don't want you to, uh, fight this thing. And honestly, I do think Maggie might be my MVP for uh, the Elite Four. So maybe try to get as much uh, experience with Maggie as much as possible. Lyron. All right, now we're getting some uh, some good encounters here. Nice. Ooh, good, good, uh, good stats. Sword stats. Ooh.
I do think, though, guillotine is pretty uh, situational. Like, most of the time it does not really work, so... I think I'll be fine with uh, a swords dancing insert. Okay, excellent. Come on, Maggie. So kind of off topic, uh, this is like in regards to the uh, Twitch chat, but I've uploaded some uh, some uh, sub icons. So by my name right there, I have a, uh, a titanium avocado for being a uh, six month subscriber. I think that's when I hit affiliate, I think. So uh, I do have a set of uh, various avocados that uh, that change. As uh, time goes on, if you get subbed uh, to them. So I have a, uh, a bronze avocado, I have a silver avocado, I have a uh, gold avocado, I have a titanium, a platinum, and then like a super sparkly one too. So I've been having like a lot of fun with uh, my uh, my Twitch, uh, my affiliate run, just making like icons and stuff uh, for the Twitch channel. Which has been like a lot of fun. And like at this point in time, like I have a, a titanium avocado next to uh, my name. But uh, yeah, I have various uh, sub badges, various uh, avocados uh, for people to have. Okay, I've been here. How fast is Sally? I don't think it's gonna be fast enough for a gold bat, but okay, it is. All right, so I'm gonna put the uh, repel up. So I'm kind of lost here at the moment because I'm circling back here. Like I've been to this area. Okay, I rolled the waterfall. Okay, I've been here. Unless it's here. No, 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 that's not it. Okay, this is where... Unless I need to go back to where uh, the strength area was, where with the rocks. So, uh, not gonna lie, I am a bit lost here. Actually, this might be the entrance. Yeah, it's the entrance. Uh, which is fine. I'm gonna head on out and heal up because my Pokemon need healing. So we'll do that, heal up, and then we'll, uh, we'll go back in afterwards. I want to check out my Hariyama very quick. Okay. So this was a new Pokemon that we got. Uh, what is your... stats? Okay, this is a pure fighting type. Its stats are not really that uh, impressive. It does have good attack though. I think its HP is pretty high too. 
Yeah, it has pretty high HP. But it'll serve as a, an alternate, just in case one of my... Like, my pincer dies or something. Alright, let's go back inside. Go around. Like, I do know the path is here, otherwise, they wouldn't put this in the game. Alright, so let's go up here. I don't think, uh, it was this part where I kind of messed up the, uh, the puzzle. So, I think I messed it up again. Okay. So I have to reset that, I think. Alright, so come back here. So don't push uh, the rock in front of me. This way. Then break this one. And then take one step down and then up. Okay, this might be it actually. Yeah, it is. Okay, I found it. I found it. Clay doll. Let's do a sword stance. See what it does. Cosmic power. Defense and special defense. Okay, this might not kill it, but let's keep going. Okay, it killed it. Found the ladder. This is another dead end. Okay, I need to go back. Unless uh, do that. Unless maybe I have to go this way. Or what's over here? Let's check out over here. Okay, that loops around. Okay, so up here. here. Okay, that's where the item is. I love getting lost. Favorite thing in the world. This is gonna be a long stream, I could just tell. 
Yeah. Go back down. Okay, and then down this way. Okay, that's where the trainer is. Uh, what's up here? Okay, that's nothing. Okay, there's this ladder. Okay, that's the dead end. Okay, I see. So it might be up and around, like from the left side. Up here. No, no, no. This way. And then I think I have to go up the waterfall. I love gold bats. So in terms of Gen 3, I don't think we get a, uh, a bug uh, TM to teach a uh, pincer. Because I think the only worthwhile bug move that we can learn in this generation is Mega Horn, but that's not a TM move, which kind of sucks. Okay, there's Vito. Kind of assuming, uh, go down this waterfall. Then down this way. This. Okay, fought you. Um, what's here? Okay, that's the, the ladder. I did pass that. Okay. Okay, this might be it, actually. So, strength here. I don't think I've been here. Okay. Alright, I'm on the way. I found it. Up, around. Okay. We're on the right, the right path. Cacturn. Caliper. I don't think we're in any danger of a Palipper. So it's, yeah, it's just gonna protect it. Because that's all a Palipper ever does, is just uh, cast Protect. Stockpile. Oh, shit. <laughs> Good move, game.
That is bullcrap. That is bullcrap. Excellent, level up. Oh shit. Okay, that wasn't stab. Alright, Maggie, you can leave. Perfect. Jesus. It's not stab. Fuck. Goodbye. Uh, sword stance and uh, fly. So protect yourself. All right, good. Awesome. And the last Pokemon will come out. Alright, Dust Clops. fine because we're doing two-turn moves. Okay. That was terrifying. Yeah, screw you guys. is there. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's the end. That's the end of uh, Victory Road. <laughs> I did sweat several times. We actually made it. Awesome, we made it. Uh, let me go to my PC and take some stuff out.
And then let's buy some stuff here. I need a lot of uh, full restores. Uh, let's get 30. And then full heals. Uh, let's get five of those. Uh, max potions. Uh, we don't need those. Those are pretty expensive. Okay. So we made it here after the terrifying battle, the ordeal that I went through. All right, let's fly on over and let's uh, let's get rid of uh, some HM moves on our team. And then we'll get ready to kind of uh, set everything up. moved it later. Uh, sure. So we want to get rid of uh, Rock Smash because it's pointless. And then I want to come over here and then I want to teach Ice Beam to you. Let's come back here. We'll get rid of uh, strength for pincer. Let's get rid of strength. And then let's get rid of another move. Let's go with uh, Maggie. Let's get rid of flash. And then one more time here. Uh, let's go with you. Get rid of a uh, waterfall. Now let's teach earthquake to. Oh, Blahaj can also learn that. Give that to Sally. Sally's gonna be our uh, heavy hitter. And Shadow Ball, uh, no one can learn that. Uh, Aerial Ace. Okay, Fluffy can learn that. Let's see, Facade. Okay, everyone can learn that. And then, uh, overheat. Okay, no one can learn that. Uh, reflect. Magneton can learn that. Okay. No, 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 I wanted to give Magneton a uh, substitute. Iron Tail, Protection, uh, Bulk Up, Bulk Up, okay, just those two. Uh, Pinsir already has Sword Stance, so it's kind of pointless to have Bulk Up on her. Uh, toxic, I think everyone can learn this. Okay, Blage is a glass cannon, so there's no point of uh, doing setup with a uh, torpedo because torpedo will die in like one hit. So we want to be offensive online. Uh, Dragon Claw.
Okay. And I think there is a move tutor uh, somewhere. So let's wander around. I think it's in Pacific Lodge Town. Is where the uh, the move tutor guy is. I might actually have to look this up. Find the uh, the move tutor guy. All right, let's go to this house. I completely forgot where the uh, the move tutor is. So let's go down here. Oh, it's another return uh, TM. Well, that's cool. I might actually teach that to uh, someone else. Like a physical attacker, another one. Uh, I'll be fluffy. Uh, probably not avocado. Yeah, fluffy might be a, a good idea. Just to give uh, fluffy some non-stab uh, damage. Dragon Dance, Dragon Breath. But uh, Sing also has its uses. You know what, screw it. Let's, let's go for it. Like, we trained Fluffy since uh, she was a little swap loot. So I'm pretty sure Fluffy like loves us to the max already. So Fluffy is a flying and dragon type. Okay, it won't do stab damage, but it's still like some good neutral damage at least. All right, and let's. That was kind of a good idea to go back to the this to find this guy because he gave us another uh, 100 base power move damage uh, TM. All right, let's do this. Probably not this house, but let me check. Okay, this is the Mirage Island uh, place. Okay, uh, where is the move tutor? I'm actually gonna look this up here. All right, Pokemon Emerald. Move tutor. Okay, the move maniac can be found in the house next to the Falabar battle tent. He will teach a move that your Pokemon will have learned at an early level to give him a heart scale. Alright, so let's do that. Let's fly over there. Falabar town. Okay. This place, maybe? Oh, Professor Cosmo. Oh, I never should have let it myself be conned into telling Team Magma where you could find meteorites. That meteorite from Meteor Falls is never going to be mine now. Oh, huh. That item. Could it be? Oh, we have the meteorite. May I have it? Uh, sure. Another return TM. Holy shit. We're getting another uh, TM. That's really cool. Uh, can we give that? We got another uh, a third return TM. Okay, let's... We can give that to Sally. Okay, we already have a uh, dick here, so I think we could just uh, teach uh, teach that to uh, Sally here. All right, we have uh, three return users.
Uh, thank you, Professor. Okay. Is this it? Okay, move tutor's house. Hello, I have, uh, heart scales. Alright, let's do avocado. Astonish. Okay, none of these are any good. To Maggie. I don't want to reteach a try attack. How about Mush Punch? I think we have the full setup already for Mush Punch. Counter, Sky upper, Uppercut. Uppercut thrown as if leaping from the sky. Like, we already have Return on Mush Punch. Let's see, Fluffy. And just checking just in case. Vice Grip. Submission. Okay, so we don't really have anything to teach our Pokémon. Uh, move tutors. I did want to give substitute to Magneton. So let me see where uh, substitute is here. Okay, double edge, dynamic punch, explosion, fury cutter, mimic, rollout, sleep talk. Uh, substitute tutor is on the rooftop of the Lily Clove uh, Mega Mart. Okay, cool. We're just doing like some really good uh, prep here. So we're almost done. So Lily Clove here, the top of the department store. And I want to give a substitute to Magneton. Finale? I just got here, though. <laughs> uh, don't worry, we still have a little ways to go. Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. I'm just, uh, teaching, getting our Pokémon ready to, uh, face, uh, the final challenge of this game. Okay, let's teach that to Maggie. Awesome. And I think uh, Pokemon's levels for the Elite Four are going to be within, like, the 50s, like, mid-50s. I think we'll be okay. I don't think we need to uh, fish out for any more levels. But let me check uh, my berries, because at the start of the stream I did uh, plant some berries, so I think they might be uh, planted already. So let's go check on them. They're still not growing. Kind of odd. That kind of sucks. Oh well. Alright, there was one last place I wanted to, uh, to go. And that was... Mauville. I think I would feel much more safer if I had a second Ice Beam uh, TM. So let's just, uh, do this. And then I would teach uh, 
Ice Beam to uh, Sharpedo. here the TMs oh that's a double team uh, TM okay we have a double team already we do have a this is the psychic TM this is flamethrower thunderbolt and then ice beam okay so let's teach ice beam to sharpedo Okay, excellent. I feel like I should teach a uh, Sharpedo something. Dragon Claw. No. Toxic. Should be like an attacking move though. I don't think it could learn Iron Iron Tail. It can't. Okay. Reflect Aerial Ace maybe. Okay. No, it can't. Tor torment, Facade, Rest, Overheat. Okay. Let me look at uh, Sharpedo's stats, though. Okay, so its special is lower than its uh, physical. Okay, so Surf, Crunch, and Ice Beam are not, uh, are not physical-based uh, moves. It's kind of a detriment. So, like, I do need to teach Sharpedo another uh, physical attack move. Like, I'm taking my time here with the preparation because uh, I don't want to go into uh, the Elite Four unprepared. Like, my levels are kind of semi-low. They're decent, but like if I went in with like level 46 Pokemon, then I feel like I would be absolutely destroyed. But still, I want to be prepared. I think you're the TM person. No. I turn. How about you? All right, might be upstairs. Okay, this is the vitamin person. Okay, this is, uh, negates all damage, but this is protect. This is, uh, safeguard. Safeguard, uh, blocks status effects. This is reflect, and this is light screen, which I don't need. Okay, this is Fire Blast, Thunder, Blizzard, Hyper Beam. I'd probably say Hyper Beam is a, a last resort move. Like, Sharpe Sharpedo would benefit from Hyper Beam because it's a physical attack. And Sharpedo has a very good, like, the highest uh, physical attack. So it might... It's better than Slash, at least. I think that's all I can do with uh, the physical moves. Okay, we'll give a Sharpedo Hyper Beam then.
Okay. So I think that might be it for preparation. I stocked up on items. Uh, they all have their final move sets. So I think it's just uh, time to get this show on the road. Alright, so let's fly over here. I'm going to give Pinsir the uh, focus band. Alright, focus band here for Pinsir. The uh, focus band prevents uh, fainting. Right, I'm going to move the, the full restores up here. We're going to move the hyper potions up here too. I kind of feel I'm a little overprepared, but I lost three Pokemon during my first two Elite Four challenges last time, and I think I'll be okay, but we'll see. Alright, let's save here. Okay, so I think... Uh, I'll take a break here, take a short break, kind of psych myself up, and then when we come back we'll finally start uh, fighting the Elite Four, one by one. So I'll take a short break, and then we come right back, and we'll get this thing started. So I will be right back. Okay guys, we are back. We are ready to do this thing. Let's head inside. Let's heal up uh, our Pokémon one last time. Let's stand here. Now, I have turned this off all game. But, I think it's finally time to turn this on. So we'll see the battle animations. Now, uh, let's get my party set up. I think we'll be okay here. So we'll save here. Alright, we are ready to go. Uh, the first trainer is a dark type trainer, I think. So we'll we'll have our bug uh, brawler Sally in the lead here. Okay, and everyone else is on standby. Alright, let's go right in. Beyond this point, only trainers who have collected all of the gym badges are permitted to enter. Trainer, let us confirm that you have all the gym badges. Believe in yourself and your Pokémon and go forth. Yes, yes, yes. Alright then, YOLO. Ooh, that's a pretty arena. Alright, let's do it. Welcome, Challenger. I'm Sydney of the Elite Four. I like that look you're giving me. I guess you'll give me a good match. That's good. Looking really good. Alright, you and me. Let's enjoy a battle that can only be staged here in the Pokemon League. This music is fucking epic. Lee for Sydney. 
Mighty Anna. Alright. Awesome, that was a good choice. Alright. Swords Dance. How dare you. This should be, uh, special. Awesome, one down. Alright, I'm gonna heal up after this. Absol. Uh, we'll stay in. So we'll heal here. Rock slide. This is not stab. Okay, that did about 64 damage. Okay, so it has rock slide. Okay. Uh, we're gonna switch to Maggie, actually. Then Maggie has some good defense. Alright, sword stance, which is fine. Thunderbolt. Okay, you have a berry. I really wish I had my citrus berries, but whatever. We don't need no stinking berries. Crawdons. Okay, let's bring in avocado. Excellent. Shift tree. Okay. Uh, let's put mush punch in. And then mock punch. It's fine. Okay, we have a, a fruit for that. I'm really glad I got the yellow fruit. <laughs> Torment. Okay. So this, uh, prevents, uh, Pokemon from using the same move, uh, twice. Okay, that's fine. Let's do a return. It's gonna do a lot of damage. Okay. We'll restore. Thankfully, I um, have these. Okay, that's a psychic attack. Alright. Uh, we're actually gonna switch here. So Maggie should be okay. Awesome. Alright, perfect. Capture. 
Okay, you're confused. Uh, Fluffy. Then fly. Awesome. Faint attack. Okay. Alright, one more hit. Cotton Spore. I think that lowers speed. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's do a Dragon Dance. Okay, so our, our attack and speed will go up. And then fly. Awesome. And GG. Awesome. Well, how do you like that? I lost. It was fun, so it doesn't matter. Yay. Listen to what this loser has to say. You've got what it you got what it takes to go far. Now go on to the next room and enjoy your next battle. Yay, one is down. And then Fluffy. Uh, focus Baton on you. The next trainer, I think, is a ghost trainer. Yeah, it looks very ghosty to me. Alright, let me uh, do this. Let me. I'm actually gonna look up the uh, trainer levels. Gonna quick glance over to the trainer levels. Okay, so uh, 51. Okay, so we're still good. All right, number two. Ha ha ha! I'm Phoebe, a elite four. Did my training on Mount Tyre. While I trained, I gained the ability to commune with ghost type Pokemon. Yes, the bond I've developed with Pokemon is extremely tight. Come on, just try and see if you can even inflict damage on my Pokémon. Okay, sure. BB. Dustclops. Alright, Crunch. Aura Protect. Hate confusion. Shadow punch. All right, excellent. Uh -huh. All right, full restore. Okay, we do have a dark type. That's really good because, uh, like ghosts do not do that much damage against dark types.
Alright, one is down. Nice, level up. Bayonet. Okay, it's another ghost type. Uh, we'll stay in. Hopefully it doesn't have Thunderbolt or something. They usually pull in their counter Pokemon after the first one goes down. But it doesn't matter. Sableye. Uh, any attack against Sableye will be uh, non-resistant. So just in case, I'm going to switch out here. And then Sableye is not a good... Uh, it's not a strong attacker, so I think uh, we could bring in a defensive Pokemon. Dragon Breath. Alright, we're gonna heal after this. And then I think I'm gonna do a Dragon Dance after. Okay, so it doesn't have Ice Punch, so we'll do, do a Dragon Dance. Okay, it does have a Shadow Ball, which is Stab. Uh, let's do another Dragon Dance, and then I'll heal after this. Okay, Nightshade, it's fine. It's gonna do another 50 damage. And then one more Dragon Breath. Or not. Okay, special defense. That's kind of a... All right, we'll heal one more time, and I think we'll switch. Okay, that didn't do that much damage, so it'll be fine. Okay, that did about 39 damage, and this is going to do 50. Okay, eventually, uh, we will hit <laughs> this Pokemon. Okay, so that's another uh, special drop. So, uh, let's switch back to you. Should not do that much damage. Nice. Okay, Surf. Alright, perfect. And a critical hit. Awesome. Dust clops. Okay. Alright, I'm actually gonna heal here and see what it does. Okay, earthquake. This is non stab. Okay. Crunch. Okay, barring a crit, we should survive this. Damn the berry. Okay, that's a problem.
crunch. Okay, surf. Full restore. Okay, fine. Okay, that was 40 damage. I'm gonna use an elixir because we're down PP. Okay. Heal again. And then crunch. Ooh, 1 HP, 1 HP. And a crit, nice. Alright, good job, uh, Blahaj. Bennett. Alright, good job, you've earned a good rest. Uh, Maggie. Let's bring Maggie out. Alright, last one. Thunderbolt. Grudge. When it wants to bear a grudge. Uh, I don't. I forgot what that does. So we're gonna double team. Just in case. I completely forgot that these ghosts might have destiny bond, so that kind of, uh, that scares me, but it doesn't matter anymore, because we just won. Yay! Alright, that's two trainers down. Three to go. I didn't recognize it, so it's only natural that I lost. Yep, I'd like to see how far your bond will carry you. Go ahead, move on to the next room. Now, the next trainer, I think, is a nice trainer. So, I think we could put Sally back here. That's a nice trainer. Alright, let me check my power points. Okay, I think we're done with Crunch. Alright, so let's give Pinsir uh, something to hold. Macho Brace. Magnet, never maltize. Uh, let's give Pinsir a, uh, a berry to thaw. Uh, Defrost's in battle. And then, I guess Maggie we can also give 
this berry. Okay, awesome. Welcome, my name is Glacia of the Elite Four. I've traveled from afar to Hoenn so that I may hone my ice skills. But all I have seen are challenges by weak trainers and their Pokémon. What about you? It would please me to no end if I could go all out against you. This might be probably one of my top favorite Elite Four music ever. Alright, let's Swords Dance a few times. And then I think the Celio is gonna hail. Yep. Which is fine. So let's do some setup. And then sword stance again. Body slam. Alright, I'll uh, heal up after this. Okay, so that's uh, three sword stances. So now we got. Uh, plus six in attack. So I think we maxed out our attack stat. Alright. Hyper Potion. Again. As long as you do not paralyze. Okay. And then Brick Break. Alright, awesome. Glalie. It's another Ice type. Alright, the hail is stopped. things go well, this might be actually be a sweep for us. Celio. This might be a sweep. <laughs> That's three down. And another Glalie. So it's just the wall rain, though. At the end. Okay. Hopefully we can be faster than the wall rain. Alright, come on. Yeah, it's the wall rain. Alright. Come on, Sally. I think that's GG. That's GG. Glacia's down. Sweep strats. Win this round. You and your Pokémon, how hot your spirits burn. All-consuming heat overwhelms. It's no surprise that my icy skills fail to harm you. Yay! Advance to the next room, and there, confine the truly fearsome side of the Pokémon League. That went so well. That went very well. Okay, so it's the last two this time. Okay, so we don't need the ice berries. Okay, Sally, and then let's bring in avocado. And then let's give avocado the, uh, let's give Avocado this. Alright, cool.
Hello, Captain Man. I am the last of the Pokemon League Elite Four, Drake the Dragon Master. In their natural straight state, Pokemon are wild living things. They are free. At times they hinder us, at times they help us. For us to battle with Pokemon as partners, do you know what it takes? Do you know what is needed? If you don't, then you will never prevail over me. Elite Four, number four. Drake and Josh. All right, Avocado. Rain Dance. Which is fine. All right, Rain Dance will boost Avocado's speed in the rain. That's part of its ability. Okay, so rain is set up. Now Ice Beam. Okay, you are going to Potion, which is fine. So, I Beam again. Ooh, so close. Uh, let's do a Surf. Altaria, okay. So we should be faster. And we'll do a double... Damn it. Rain stopped. Okay. Ice Beam. Okay. Good defense. Set up another rain dance. Okay. Okay, we're gonna heal this time. Okay, rain dance. The rain is set. Okay, we should move next after this. Okay, awesome. Altaria is down. Kingdra. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, we'll stay in. Uh, Giga Drain. Okay, I think uh, Kingdra also benefits from uh, from the the rain too. Damn it. Okay, that's fine. All right, the rain is gone, so let's full restore. Dragon Dance, oh boy. Okay, so it has Body Slam, and then let's switch in Maggie. Damn it. Okay. All 
Alright, Surf, Body Slam, Smoke Screen, and then Dragon Dance. Okay, it's dead. Salamence, okay. Alright. So, Blahaj might die. Blahaj might die from this, but... Okay, that's fine. Alright. We have our other Ice Beam user here. Alright, Dragon Claw. Should do a lot of damage. Okay. But we have Rust Rough Skin. Damn it! And it has the berry. Okay. Okay, so it has Dragon Claw. Switching in. Fuck. Has rock slide. Shit. All right. Heal again. And flamethrower. Shit. Uh hmm. Fluffy. So you're gonna flamethrower again for Dragon Claw. Fuck. That's flamethrower, Dragon Claw, Rock Slide. Ice Beam. Okay. That was scary. That was really scary. Okay. Get out of here. Buffy, thank you. Why gone? Uh, we're staying in. Okay. Heal up here. Earthquake. Uh, should not do that much damage. Yeah, we're resistant to that. Alright, Ice Beam again. Yeah, goodbye. That was scary. <sighs> Superb, it should be said. You deserve every credit for coming this far as a trainer of Pokémon. You do seem to know what is needed. Yes, a trainer needs a virtuous heart. Pokémon touch the good hearts of trainers and let them learn good from wrong. They touch the good hearts of trainers and grow strong. Go. Go onwards. The champion is waiting. Ooh, the fucking champion. God, that was... That was really, uh... A lot. 
That was uh, pretty scary. No one died yet. Okay. So, uh, hmm. All right, good job. Take this. that on you and then avocado uh, let's do max elixir then max elixir on uh, Maggie Just in case. Uh, I'm gonna open up with avocado first. And then let's not ice, amulet coin, black glasses, macho brace. Uh, what can I give you? Uh burn, defrost, PP. The only berries that I have are uh, Orin berries. That kind of uh, that kind of stinks, but okay. All right then, we are ready to go. I have not saved since uh, I started. Uh, this is the team that will have to take down six Pokemon, but I think we'll be okay. Ooh, we get the longer hallway. Oh, you look familiar. Hi, Annie. That incident at Sutopolis City, that was superb work, putting an end to that crisis all by yourself. Oops. Would it be fair to say that you alone ended the crisis? You overcame that difficult situation by working as one with your Pokémon. We trainers raise Pokémon by giving them items and by teaching them new techniques for battle. But we ourselves also learn many things from Pokémon. And this is where your achievements are put to the test against what others like you have achieved. Now, who can most elegantly dance with their Pokemon in Hoenn? Show me right here and now. Let's fucking go. Champion Wallace. Waylord. Uh, Giga Drain. Rain Dance, thank you, that'll only help me. I never got a Miracle Seed item. Okay. That will boost my uh, speed. Awesome. Okay. They're gonna full restore. Oh, Blizzard. Okay. That would do like neutral damage to us. Okay, yeah, they're gonna full restore. Okay, so Rain Dance Blizzard.
it's really cool that we we have a water champion in this in this game. Because a water is really powerful as a uh, a Pokemon type. Okay. This will do neutral damage. Might heal though. Oh, okay. Giga Drain. Awesome, level up. That's very good. One is down. Uh, Tentacruel. Okay, that's a poison type. Uh, what do I want to bring in? Okay. So poison is resistant to steel, so I think Maggie should step up. And I think we'll start setting up uh, double team strats. Alright, so let's uh, start doing that. Uh, double team. Shit. Hydro pump. That's three. Let's set up another double team. Okay, that's four. Okay, so Hydro Pump has five power points, I think. So if we could just survive this, it'll be okay. Okay, survive it, survive it, survive it. Okay, awesome. Okay, that's five Hydra Pumps. Okay, so Ice Beam. Awesome. Okay, knowing this game, I'm going to heal here because Tenacro might have a sixth Hydra Pump. And just uh, KO me outright. Okay. It's not a Hydra Pump. Alright. Double team again. Okay, this is four. Or three, I think. And then I'm going to double team six times here to max out my evasion. All right, lemonade. All right, so let's do another uh, double team. Okay, so Tentacruel has uh, Ice Beam, Hydro Pump, and then I'm assuming Sludge Bomb. And then I don't know what the other move is. Okay, so our evasion will not go any higher. So then I'm gonna pop substitute here. Okay, awesome. Now I'm gonna heal again. I've never used substitute before. So this will be fun. All right, then we're gonna do straight damage. Okay, his last move was uh, toxic. Alright, good to know. Alright, yeah, Sludge Bomb, Toxic, Hydro Pump, and then Ice Beam. Alright, another one down. Gyarados, okay. Gyarados should not survive a Thunderbolt. As long as it doesn't have a, an Earthquake, we'll be fine. It does have an Earthquake, but it missed. A Gyarados with Earthquake is fucking terrifying. Ooh, 
Whiskat. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Damn, I don't have another move for that. Okay. Unfortunately... Okay, Waylord, Gyarados, Tentacruel. Okay. So he's down three Pokémon. I don't have any other Pokémon that can... Okay, we'll have to go back to Avocado. But let me, uh... Save here first. Just to see what it does. Because I need to heal up, uh, Avocado. Okay. Okay, that actually hit us. Alright. Okay, so the substitute is broken, so let's switch in. Alright, awesome. Okay, we have three Giga Drains left. I'm actually gonna use an elixir here. Amnesia. Okay. Alright, that's gonna raise your uh, special defense. So Geek Dream will do less damage. Oh, Hyper Beam. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that didn't do that much damage. Okay, you're gonna... Wallace is gonna pop the potion. Or no, no. Okay, yeah, he is. He is. Okay, that's fine. Kind of hoping for a critical hit here. We'll just uh, keep this going. Okay. All right, three more. We should be fine here. Okay. Now, there might be a good chance Wallace will pop the potion again. But let's see. Uh, yeah, he did it again. So I'm gonna restore my uh, Giga Drain uh, power points again. Eventually, a critical hit will, uh, will happen. Okay, that was a crit. That's fine. Giga Train. Okay, we're getting closer. Hyper Beam. Okay. Nice, our Orenberry came through. Okay, that's a uh, Whisk Hatch. Milotic. Okay. 
We're going to switch here. And then I'm actually going to bring in Mush Punch here. Mush Punch may die to an Ice Beam. But... Mush Punch may die to an Ice Beam here. But let's do Leech Seed. Mush Punch, you have been a good Pokemon throughout the beginning. Okay. You have been a good Pokemon since the beginning. You've done your job. Thank you for taking me this far, Mush Punch. Okay. Now. It would have Surf, Ice Beam, and then I'm assuming Mirror Coat, but let's uh, paralyze Milotic. Ooh. Okay, so that was a powerful uh, Surf. Bring in our, our safe option here. So we'll heal up here. Okay, 47. Nice. Wow, that did nothing. Okay, they're gonna do the berry. They have a citrus berry. And then one more Giga Drain after this. Unless he does a full restore. Oh, you have a recover. Damn it. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I'm gonna snooze ads here. Okay, so we're out of a uh, PP for Giga Drain again. This is the real match right here. Okay, Giga Drain. Well, I keep on going. Toxic. Okay, that's uh, we have potions for that though. Avocado is really coming in clutch here. Like avocado was not even considered like gonna be like one of my final Pokemon, but avocado is doing such a good job right here, just staying, staying, asshole, just staying here, like matching toe to toe with uh, Milotic.
Okay, so the paralysis is gone. Okay, let's keep going. Toxic, I can uh, recover from that. Keep going. Okay. Full restore. Uh, full restore. Nice beam. Will this do it? Will this do it? Did it do it? It did. It did. Perfect. Milotic is gone. A Ludic Ludicolo. Okay. Now. Who do we sub in? Alright. Ludicolo is, uh, water and grass type. We'll bring in Fluffy. Okay. Fluffy will fly, and just to check if, uh, Ludicolo has an ice beam. But let's fly. Okay, does it have an ice beam? Okay, it has a double team. Has double team. Fly again. Okay. So it doesn't look, look like it has a ice beam, maybe. Okay, it has a surf. But we'll try that again. Yeah, double team strats are really annoying, but then again, I've also used them. Okay, is that it? Is that it? That's it! That's it! They did it! Two-time Nuzlocke champion! I, the champion, fall in defeat. We freaking did it! That was wonderful work. You were elegant, infuriatingly so. And yet it was utterly glorious. Kudos to you. You're a true noble Pokémon trainer. Yay! The Pokémon you sent into battle. At times they danced like a spring breeze, and at times they struck li like lightning. It was light, yet sure-footed. Elegance that led to your Pokémon. Even I felt bem bedazzled by your masterful performance. You now stand at the glorious peak of the Pokémon League. And now became you to be the new Hoenn region. Oh, fuck. Brandon. Brandon, get the fuck out of here. This is not your moment. Annie. How would you like some advice before you challenge a champion? Uh, I don't take my advice from scrubs. Get lost. Annie. Are you trying to tell me you've beaten the champion? See? What did I tell you, Brandon? Didn't I tell you that you didn't need to worry about An Annie? Annie, you've finally done it. When I heard that you defeated your own father at the Paleburg Gym, I thought perhaps you had a chance. To think you actually become the champion. Ah, yes. You came in your Pokedex. So you've seen 151 and caught 51. You're any, using any rods or many Pokemon in the sea. Anyways, congratulations. Now probably go into the final room. Annie. No, let me rephrase that properly. The new champion. Come with me. I'm sorry, but no scrubs allowed. Get out of here, loser. From here on, only those trainers who become champions may enter. Yeah, get the fuck out, loser. Brandon. You'll have to wait outside with Professor Birch like all the other losers. What? 
It can't be helped if that's the rule. Way to go. Con congratulations. Yeah, get lost, loser. This room. This is where we keep records of Pokemon prevailed through harsh battles. It is here that League Champions are honored. Come on, let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokemon League and the names of the partners who battled with you. I kind of feel like an idiot for letting Mush Punch die. <laughs> that was kind of a stupid decision. But... Okay. Avocado, the true MVP of the run. Thank you. Sally, doing good job. Lahaj, our last uh, trainer of Pokemon. Rest in peace, Much Punch, but you did very well. As did Fluffy. And Maggie. You guys did incredible. Yay! League champion. Uh, pay no attention to uh, the time there. 74 hours and 30 minutes. A lot of that was fast forward. A lot of that was uh, fast forwarding. And that's Pokemon Emerald. So, I, Mush Punch, all the Pokemon I captured, and all the Pokemon that died along the way. But yeah, that was, uh, despite a couple of uh, times uh, I wasn't able to stream and my hand health issues, like, that was a good run of uh, Pokemon Emerald. That was my first uh, Nuzlocke run with this game, and it was rough. Honestly, it was rough as a Nuzlocke, because like, the RNG wasn't with me at the time. I could have uh, destroyed Brawly in the second gym if I had a, a Talo, or if I caught a bird Pokemon. But uh, like my first team got absolutely obliterated in uh, Brawly's gym. But that was probably the defining moment where uh, I kind of turned it around very quickly. And I remember having only like three grass type Pokemon. I had the Oddish, I had a, a Lotad, and I think I had a, I caught a, a Gyarados too that also died. But uh, slowly, slowly but surely, I've uh, built myself up to challenge the third gym and then we won that battle with uh, Mush Punch. And then slowly but surely I accumulated a strong party here. And uh, let's see. So we had Mush Punch, we had uh, Hercules number two, the Gyarados. We had a coughing, I caught a coughing named uh, Sunshine. Uh, Avocado was our HM friend the majority of the game and it wasn't until uh, after I got the uh, the six badge the flying badge there was that, that moment in route uh, 121 where I fought against uh, a double battle and it was raining and they had a Manitrek and a cast form that completely destroyed half of my party and I lost the Gyarados I lost the uh, the the coughing and then the uh, camera up so I had to rebuild, and I got uh, Magneton, I got Pinsir, and then I brought Avocado back into the party. And then uh, I caught a Spiel afterwards, but then while I was training it, the Spiel died uh, while I was uh, fast-forwarding it. So I had to replace it with a Sharpedo, which was the encounter that I got on Route uh, 119 that should have been a, uh, a Feebas, but... Uh, Sharpedo did very well. Let's go here, and then... 
let's go into the game. Alright, cool. So, let us, uh, go back down. Oh, our dad's home. Hmm? <laughs> Hey, it's Annie. It's been a while since I saw you, but you look stronger somehow. That's the impression I get, but your old man hasn't given up yet. Oh yes, I have something for you. This came from you from someone named Mr. Brittany. SS ticket. A ticket for a ferry. If I recall, there are ferry ports in Slayport and Lily, Lily Cove. I better get back to Petalburg Gym. Mom, thanks for looking after the house while I'm away. Calls her mom too. <laughs> it's kind of weird. That dad of yours. Comes home for the first time in a while. But all he talks about is Pokemon. She relaxed and stay a little longer. Oh. Is that a breaking news story? And I immediately run to the TV. We bring you this emergency news flash. In various Hoenn locales, there have been reports of a bzzz colored Pokemon in flight. The identity of this Pokemon is currently unknown. We're now returning to our regularly mov movie program. Annie, did you catch that? What color did the announcer say the Pokemon was? Uh... Oh, this might be uh, for a... Uh, Blatty Pokemon. Let's go with blue. It doesn't matter, honestly. Okay, now we can leave. Um, oh, come on. Like, they were just waiting outside. <laughs> they were just looking through the window. Like, uh, going like, Oh, has she come down yet? Oh, give it another, like, five minutes. She's probably gonna come down. Okay, 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 we'll stand right here. We'll just wait for her and deliver the news. Well, well, Annie. That was quick work. That was good work out there. I knew there was something special about you when I first saw you. You literally talked to me, like, five minutes ago. But I never expected this. Oh yes, do you still have your Pokedex that I gave you? Uh, this is probably the National Pokedex. Now, Annie and Brendan have had the two of you help me study Pokemon. Thanks to your help, new facts are coming to light. It appears that in the Hoenn region there are Pokemon from other regions. It goes to show how rich and varied the natural environments of Hoenn happen to be. That's why I think it's necessary for me to upgrade your Pokedex to the national mode. Let me see your Pokedex. I went over Poen and checked out Pokemon. You could thank me for getting the national mode Pokedex. I am not gonna thank you for anything. Yep, you're lucky. I never thought of it before, but I really hate Brendan. Probably even worse than I hate Scott. Okay, all done. Yeah, like, fuck Scott. Fuck Brendan. You become the champion, but your Pokemon journey isn't over. There's no end to the road that is Pokemon. Somewhere there's a grassy patch waiting for you. Can I leave now, please? Thank you. I want to celebrate on my own terms. Okay, let's go to a city. Uh, let's go to... Uh, not, not there. Let's go to the Pokemon League. But uh, yeah, this was a fun Nuzlocke experience. It was really, really challenging. It was really, really difficult. <laughs> it was much harder than uh, my Fire, my Leaf Green uh, playthrough. But, uh, of course, as always, we must say goodbye to the Fallen. Uh, Mush Punch, you've done very well. But it is time to, uh, set you off on that boat ride with, uh, Frodo and, uh, Yugi Moto. Yes, uh, are dead. Again, it was a very good challenge run. A lot of fun, very challenging. Uh, I went over my thoughts before about uh, what happened. But uh, yeah, this was a good run. And uh, it'll be a little while until I do my next uh, Pokemon challenge. 
but uh, it uh, it will be a while for sure. But I am gonna be looking forward to it. My next Pokemon challenge run will be Pokemon Platinum. That's gonna be really fun to do. But uh, as far as that goes, I am going to uh, uh, sign off on Pokemon here, and then uh, tomorrow I'm gonna be. Going back to Final Fantasy XIV, we're going to continue uh, with the story finally. Uh, but first we'll be doing some fun uh, stuff with uh, Hildebrand, the Heavensward Hildebrand questline. So that's going to be fun, a lot of fun. And then I think after that, I'm going to be devoting myself to Final Fantasy XIV. We'll continue with post-Heavensward stuff, continue the story, and then we will go from there. But uh, we will be back with Pokemon uh, for sure down the line next year. It looks like ads are going to start, but that's... Okay, I'm going to wrap up anyway. So let me do this. Socials. Uh, my YouTube channel. Where uh, this VOD will go up on YouTube. Uh, we have a Discord community. And I have a Patreon. And I'm open for art commissions. Uh, so yeah, Final Fantasy 14 tomorrow, so... Thank you all for watching, for following, for lurking, uh, for just having me as your background, uh, as your background, stre uh, background stream. Uh, thank you all for joining me today, uh, and I will see you all next time. So take care, everyone. Have a good night, and take care.